Hi friends, welcome to Sri Sai IT Hub. In this video of Core Java Programming, we are going to discuss the following topic. Ternary Operator in Java Program. Right. So first of all, let us start with what is Ternary Operator. okay so ternary so ternary means three okay so this operator takes three values to perform the operation okay so it takes three values to perform the operation okay so it is also called as conditional operator so conditional operator so what is this operator so the operator is question mark followed by colon so this is the operator so how to use the operator so the syntax goes like this expression one question mark expression two colon expression three okay so this is the standard syntax to work with ternary operator or conditional operator now how this is executed or evaluated in a program okay so two cases if expression one is true then expression two is executed if expression one is true then expression two is executed okay so similarly we can also take it like this if expression one is false so this is case two if it is false then what is the situation okay so if it is false then expression three is executed okay so if expression one is true expression two is executed if expression one is false then expression 3 is executed right so let us try to implement this in the form of a java program so we'll take this as ternary operator example 1 dot java so program to perform ternary operation okay right so let us take a new page first write the comments ternary operation so class ternary operator example one so we'll write the main method public static void main string of orcs right so ternary operator example one so let us save this program in our working directory so we'll save this as ternary operator example one dot java right okay so ternary operator example one so let us take two values int a is equals to 11 int b is equals to something like 5 we'll take one more value result okay so let us apply ternary operation on a and b using expression 1 expression 2 and expression 3 
so we'll take it as something like this a greater than b okay so a greater than b so we'll take uh, okay here result okay let the result be there a greater than b then a else b and we'll store this in results so 11 greater than 5 true then expression 2 is executed so what is expression 2 a so a value is assigned to result so let's print the result here system dot out dot print a is bigger okay a is bigger right so let us save this go to the command prompt so compile the program java c ternary operator example one and run it so we should get the answer here as a 11 is bigger okay right so let us take another case here same example right okay here instead of a we'll give it as result so result is 11 11 is bigger okay right so let us take one more example right so result a less than b then assign a value to result or b so let us try to execute this a less than b 11 less than 5 false so false means expression 3 should, should be executed so what is expression 3 here b so b value is assigned to result now which is 3 okay so print result is smaller okay because we are checking for less than it is smaller value right so let us try to compile and run this so recompile and then rerun so 11 is bigger next 5 is smaller right so next we can also take something like this string uh something like message okay right so i'll take something like message is equals to okay we'll take it as a equals to b then a and b are same a and b are same otherwise we'll print it as something like this a and b are not same okay are not same right so here initially a is equals to b 11 equals to 5 false false means expression 3 should be executed so this is a message a and b are not same so this will be assigned to message so let us print the message here system dot out dot println message okay right, so let's go to the command prompt recompile and rerun so a and b are not same 11 is not equals to 5 okay let us make a small change here for the same example so here we'll take a is equals to 10 b is equals to 10 now both are same in this last case so again now execute this statement message assigned with 10 equals to 10 true 
so true means expression 2 is executed a and b are same so this is assigned to message print message a and b are same so recompile and rerun so previously 11 pi a and b are not same now 10 10 a and b are same so this is how we are supposed to work with ternary operator so ternary operator it takes three values expression one expression two expression three to perform the operation and it is also called as conditional operator right thank you for watching this video do like and share this video and subscribe to the youtube channel sri sai it hub have a nice day